While Bill and the governor both are saying that we may not get as much ice as we first had forecasted, governor says it should still be more than enough to cause problems. LAX 18's political reporter Carolina Buchek joins us now live from Frankfurt with details on how state leaders are responding. Yeah, the governor says make no mistake, this storm can still cause some problems right now in Frankfurt. It's just raining. It's a very cold rain, but it is just rain at this point. But when it does become ice, it is going to cause two particular issues. The first one, of course, roads and even big ones, interstates, they are going to be in rough shape. And then there's the power issue. Take a look across the street. You see that above ground power pole? Well, that's what we have here in Kentucky. We have above ground power poles mainly. And and they accumulate ice. So the governor says that could likely result in some power outages. Now, of course, that freaks some people out because they think, oh gosh, is this going to be as bad as the, for example, 2009 ice storm? Well, good news is the state does not think things will get that bad, but it all depends on what happens over the next several hours. Utility crews are, however, ready to respond. They're already doing it. Road crews are also out there, but remember, it's going to take time to clear the roads. 1500 plows and heavy pieces of equipment are out there, but they need a while to effectively clear things out. Please give us a day uh, to interact with the weather conditions. It's still going to be rough on Friday, but give us a day for the transportation cabinet to do the fine work that they do across uh, across the state. Now, the governor says as of right now, there are no plans to close the interstates. Last month, we saw a bunch of people get trapped out on the interstates when that heavy snow came. The state is hoping to avoid that, but they are not taking the closure route for now. Live in Frankfurt, Carolina Butrek, Elite 18 News.